Oh, well. Look what the cat dragged in. Looks like you're looking as good as ever. You got that little glow up you told me about. Guess you weren't kidding. Oh, why so surprised? It's me, your little old ex-bully. <laughs> Did that surprise you? I think by now I'd be in some biker game like you always assumed, huh? Mind if I take a seat? <sighs> so, what are you doing here? Oh, studying. Such a nerd as always, huh? Well, at least you sit to your brand. <laughs> so, how have you been these past few years? You seem to be keeping yourself busy. Heck, I would have thought you've given up on your dreams by now. I guess my presence is the only thing you need to get rid of for you to focus, huh? <laughs> You're quite lucky we need to move out. Who knows what would have happened if I stayed. <sighs> well, it wasn't a pleasant experience for sure. Hmm? What? Oh that. Yeah, I never really got to talk to you about it. You sure you want to hear it? It might bore you. Besides, it seems like you got something going on. Huh? <sighs> Fine, I'll tell you. I guess the easiest way I can say is... My parents had this one big fight and my dad moved out. My mom was struggling to sustain us, so we moved back to my grandma's. Stayed there for a few years and gone to a new school. By a miracle, <laughs> I graduated. What? Did you think I would be able to find someone to bully there? Oh, come on. You were my favorite guy to bully. Even though I never really met all of that, it was just fun to tease you. I never really got to tell you all of the reasons why I did those things. Plus, I never got to understand what I meant to you. I know at some point after I left, I didn't get the chance to say sorry or even goodbye to you. Yeah, I mean it. I'm sorry. Don't get your hopes up. Now that I've apologized, I don't think I owe you anything else. As far as I've done, I haven't really caused you any physical damage, have I? But really, I know how hard words can hurt, so I hope you forgive me. I'm not really asking for it. You could still never forget about them, and that's okay. I'll take accountability for it. Oh. <laughs> so you do have a heart after all. <sighs> and here I thought you'd have some sort of grudge against me. Hm. Maybe you are much nicer than I initially thought. Yeah, well, I sometimes just saw you all alone in school. There's a spa in the library that you will always go to. It's in the science section, and not a lot of people go to it because... Well, it's not an interesting subject for most of the student population. Oh, please. I saw a couple make out in one of the library sections during our time. Trust me when I say they were really getting at it. Oh, you haven't seen those kinds of situations yet? Hmm, maybe that's just because they saw you there in the first place. Somewhere with people isn't really the best place to, you know, 
make out. <laughs> what are you so surprised for? Don't tell me you still haven't found yourself a girl. You've always been gushing about the prom queen herself, knowing you were out of her league. But if I were to judge by now, guess that globe showed something, huh? I'm surprised you still haven't found yourself a partner. Hmm? Well, me? Not so much. I haven't really gone into dating ever since I moved there. I had focused on my studies. Well, I needed to. I even have to do some part-time job to help out. Hmm? Right now? I had two job interviews earlier, so... I'm trying to get some extra cash. I plan to move back here in an apartment. My mom told me I should go back and not hold myself back because of her. <sighs> she's always so stubborn. Thinking she's a burden to me. Really. People are sometimes too honest with their feelings. Oh, yeah. Didn't you go on a date with that one girl you met online? <laughs> I never really got to know what happened. I figured it bombed. Hmm. I guess so. Well, I can't blame you. It takes a special kind of eye to see something in you. What? You think I don't see it? You're a guy who's a bit... Say desirable for others with a certain type. I mean, like, right now. Have you seen how people have been constantly looking at you? Can't say I'm the same, but... Something just made me want to say hi to you. Maybe it's how I remember you as to how I was able to recognize you. Hmm. What's that look on your face? Don't say I got anything on me while talking to me the entire time. I swear, if you... Huh? What do you mean, like you... Could... What? That's... <sighs> okay, calm down. Calm down. <clears throat> well, cats out of the back, I guess. You have good ears, so... Yeah. I said what I said. Y you want me to repeat it? <sighs> Fine. I like you for... For a long while now. I guess it started when I left. I reminisced a bit about the time we spent together. Albeit, they weren't the most pleasant memories for you, but... I guess that's that for me. Don't push your luck, okay? I'm not looking for a relationship right now, but... If you're open to hang out, then... Maybe. If you want, we can... Get some pizza, or go to the movies, or something. You know, hatch them on what we could have done and make some new memories. I told you already that you don't have to forgive me about how I did. If you're going to say no, then best you... Oh. So you're already over it, huh? <laughs> Look at me. I guess I'm the one holding myself back now. Fine, then. I'll DM you later where we can meet. Or if you have suggestions. Sure. Just not somewhere nerdy. <laughs> right. Well, I have to go now. Still gotta run a few more errands. I only came here for coffee, really. <laughs> well then, I hope we can repatch some stuff about the past and bury it together. <laughs> yeah, I'll see you around. <laughs>